So I have a new Python application here which says convert color.py which is nothing but a duplicate copy of the read.py that we created earlier. And we have this image color.jpg and we are trying to convert this image into a different colored profile. So right now we can see that it's a colored image and let's see how OpenCV can allow us to change into different other color profiles. So let's open the convert.color file. So CV2, CVT color is nothing but an OpenCV function that allows us to change the color profile of the image that we are reading. So we have this image and we have stored it in this variable called img and we can call this function convert color to make our changes. So what we can do is let's call this image instead of img I'll call it as a source and we'll say we'll save it as a source variable and now we will call a new function convert so cv2 cvt color and that's the function name it takes in two arguments more importantly if you're using python one is the image variable that is being stored so we use src in our case and the second variable is defining the color profile you want to change it to and in our case we're going to try to change it to bgr2 gray and we call it with cv2 bgr2 gray so what is what this is doing is it's saying bgr2 gray and the reason for that is when OpenCV reads any image, or the image is nothing but a matrix, and OpenCV reads the image in a BGR format, and we are changing it into a grayscale image, a black and white grayscale image. So that is the reason we call BGR2 gray, and it's not the typical RGB format. Once this is done, we want to save this converted image into our img variable, which can display the image for us. We will call another function, cv2 im show image original image. We'll call this window original image so we can see the difference between our source image and our converted image we will call this as a converted image let's save this let's open our command terminal and run convert color dot pi so we can see it has opened up two windows for us one is the original image and the second is the converted grayscale image once we have seen this we can press the escape button and it will close both the windows for us. Now let's go back to this convert color by and let's comment this guy and see what else this convert color function can do for us. So apparently OpenCV allows converting colors from one format to many other formats. We'll see two or three different formats in our case, just to understand how this function works. So we will now call convert color. Same case, we're calling the main source file. And we are now invoking color BGR to HSV. HSV is a format which says hue, saturation, and variance. So the difference between HSV and BGR is nothing. It's not much of a big difference because both of them are representing the colored profiles of the image. But in case of BGR, it is represented in three different colored notations. So it's B stands for blue, G stands for green, R stands for red. So all these three color mix in one form or the other in the matrix to give us that colored profile. But in case of hue, saturation, and variance, hue is what holds the colored values. Saturation holds the amount of that color that should be shown. And variance 
is the brightness level of that particular image. So H, it allows us to vary the colored profile. Now, this is being used in a lot of object detection and blob detection functions. So the reason for that is because in case you want to convert or in case you want to track a particular color, you will have to change and manipulate all these three values independently so you can monitor that particular color. But in case of HSV, as long as you monitor H and change the value of H because H can vary from one color range to the other color range in our colored profile and that one variable can help us in converting or functioning out controlling the colored profile in our functions. So that is the reason HSV works out very good in that way. Uh, let's see how it displays like. Once we are done, we just save this. We go back to our Python application and we run colored convert.py. So we can see the HSV now looks like this and original image is this. So this is how the HSV, HSV comes looks like. I'll press escape and it will close. We'll come back and we will see one another, one other convert color dot by. We'll call again ing equal to cv2 convert color source file cv2 color. And in case of BGR to HSV, we will do BGR to RGB. So let's see what this does. Now, OpenCV itself is designed to read images in the format of BGR, but not everyone reads in the BGR format. There are many machine learning libraries and functions which use the RGB format. So in order for OpenCV to work with those functions, with those machine learning libraries, it is important for us to convert into RGB file. If at all you come across such a project which represents, which is being represented by an RGB image. So we'll do this, we'll save it, we'll come back, and now we will run python convert.py. So this is how our HSV image looks like. So we can see how the, what's the difference between both of them. So this is RGB. This is in the BGR format, I'm sorry. This is in the BGR format, and this is in the RGB format. So we can see how, how it's different when reading with OpenCV.